Assalamualaikum See you again My brother My friends If yesterday You have watched my video About how to start How to begin The damage analysis Of the laptop motherboard And We have discussed About The Asus motherboard That black screen or no display caused by a voltage that allows the voltage that's supplying the memory of the figure and now the question is how to fix this motherboard okay here this is the motherboard that i have show you yesterday this motherboard with no voltage at this block the voltage of the ram of the figure okay now we will finding the problem source of the voltage at this block uh, why no voltage at this point the causes of this problem usually caused by the broken of this controller ic or something wrong at this at this line the line of the output of this IC here I will try to to do uh, the, the steps from the uh, easy steps mulai dari steps yang paling mudah itu maksudnya ya nanti kalau gagal kita kita lanjut ke step selanjutnya yang lebih sulit <coughs> Okay, here I will add SMD capacitor at this at this line. Uh, you know, you know this. Uh, at, you know here that this is the the uh, the icon of the capacitor, but but the capacitor not not installed here. So I will try to add a SMD capacitor at this line because usually <coughs> the voltage will not appear if the capacitive fa value at the certain line for example at this line if the, the capacitive value at this line uh, not match with standard I mean the the capacity value at this line uh, not as the normal condition so this will causing the voltage not appear at this line okay now I will add, uh, try to add uh, SMD capacitor here I have a small SMD capacitor with size 200 microfarad with voltage 2.5 okay the, the capacitor with code EJH okay the size of this capacitor is 200 microfarad with, with voltage 2.5 fault okay we'll add here using the heater blower I often do these steps before try to to do uh, other steps that more difficult and usually this success if no uh,
okay if no other uh, something wrong with with other lines okay wait until the temperature done until temperature decreasing to normal temperature if this okay one once again you should know that uh, before do these steps you must sure that this line not short to the ground because if this line sorted to the ground this means that uh, a component that connected directly with this line have broken and we must find it find this component to fix the problem of this motherboard this line not sorted so I try to add a SMD capacitor here okay let's check the voltage at this block at this point prepare the multitester as we have explained you yesterday or you can watching my yesterday video okay plug the charger ensure that the position of the motherboard is safe okay plug the charger turn on this motherboard okay and check the voltage this is from the charger okay now you can see here this is the voltage the voltage of the ram of figure now the voltage has appeared 1.3 volt so i think this step uh, success and fix this what or what okay i will check this motherboard using the external monitor this is the cable to external monitor this is my dirty external monitor okay turn on the motherboard it is working and let's see on this dirty monitor okay all right this is working well I think this motherboard working well now and job finished okay my friend this is the steps to fix the no display motherboard uh, the Asus mat uh, laptop motherboard with model X555 QG uh, thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe my channel and click the bell and like and share this video see you again in the next video wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh